Hello, this is Netta. Welcome to my channel. I am here with a couponing haul from Walgreens. Y'all know I go to Walgreens every now and then because I found the point system. Y'all, it's just too much for me to even keep up with. I'd rather have some ECBs in my hand. And let's not talk about Rite Aid, okay? But, um... While we at the Walgreens tip, I am going to go ahead and go over what I picked up at Walgreens. Um, <clears throat> you guys, they currently have the Speed Stick and the Lady Speed Stick. Buy one, get one half off. And when you purchase two of them, you get 3,000 points. Which is equivalent to $3. See, already that's just too much to know. Okay, or even to remember. Alright. Alright, so let me show you. In my store, the Speed Stick Overtime costs $4.19. And half of that is $2.10. Okay, so I just picked up two. Now we'll let you know. When my cashier rung it up, it just rung up two of the Fort 19. She had to go in manually and put in the half price um, in the cash register. I don't know what's going on with the system. Um, she said something about they received the register late. I'm not sure what that means, but she had to manually put in the half price. So be sure to check your receipt or even look at the screen. To make sure you get your second one half off. So $4.19 plus $2.10 is $6.29. Then I had this buy one get one free coupon. And you guys please do not misuse this coupon. It's for the Speed Stick Overtime or Speed Stick Average Spring. Alright. And it says Lady Speed Stick Unstoppable Anti-Durant Only. Okay, I ain't seen no unstoppable, so I couldn't get that. But anyway, when my cashier put in the price for the second one as two ten, you guys, she was unable to let me get it three forty nine taken off as the free one. So she took off the two ten, which is the lesser of both. I know some of you guys were lucky enough to get 349 because when the truth be told when the coupon scan it will take off 349 but you're going to have some cashiers that's going to go in and give you the 210 off or half the half price off which was in my case all right so 629 minus the free item brought me back down to 419 then I picked up four of the Lady Speed Stick because they fall in the same um, group. 3,000 points when you pick up two. So I just did two more sets of it. Okay. So again, it's buy one, get one half off. And again, it did not catch the half off. So she had to manually um, put in the $1.60. So 319 plus $1.60. 319 plus $1.60 equals nine dollars and fifty cents then i had four of the 50 cent off coupons located on october 15 smart sauce all right because i didn't want to misuse the coupon you guys the buy one get one free coupon it was only for a specific lady speed stick so it took off two dollars which brought me down to seven dollars and fifty cents all right so i add these two together from the speed stick 419 plus 750 is 1169 and because I picked up six of them, remember, for every two, I got 3,000 points. Three, six, nine thousand points. So, I paid the cashier $11.69 plus tax. But in turn, I got 9,000 points added to my account, which is equivalent to $9. So, really... I paid $2.69 for all of these 
or 43 cents each. Now you guys, I'm sure you guys are lucky to get all this free plus the money maker. But just know, there is a possibility that your cashier or your store won't give you the full price of the coupon. They will give you the price of the half off item. So I'm just keeping you posted so there will be no surprises because when you coupon you guys there's you're always taking a chance all right let me show you what else i picked up all right what i just showed you is the main reason why you should do your homework before you go couponing you guys and I'm glad I did and sometimes I have to especially with stores I'm really not familiar with like I said I'm familiar with it but I just don't like dealing with those points and there are a lot of times even computers can be wrong okay so when my cashier rung these up um, there really wasn't any issue other than it didn't give me half off you saw the little clip before. It says buy one get one half off. It wanted to charge me seven dollars and forty nine cents for all four of them. You know I'm not going. Mm -mm, that's not even a deal, you guys. Okay, so I'd be like, uh uh. I said, says this in your ad. Beauty and skincare essentials. Buy one, get one fifty percent off with card on same brand. So I got the same brand. For the buy one get one free so you have to get the same brand and i did that all right but the little tag that's hanging on the shelf it just tells me about the points i'm gonna get it doesn't say anything about buy one get half off now the bigger bottle says buy one get one half off plus points but the tag that's on the shelf just say get points so some say so i said some not right so I went on my app that I just showed you guys, and it definitely say buy one get one half off, and it does say 16 ounce, and it showed you can see on there, but it showed the location of the store. Okay, I made sure I had the location of the store um, on my app, and and it shows 16 ounces as you saw. So um, she made that change, and again, each of them seven dollars and forty nine cents. Plus three dollars and seventy-five cents equals eleven twenty-four. So two of them will total eleven twenty-four with the buy one get one half off. So because I purchased another set of two, I just multiply the eleven twenty-four times two, which total twenty-two forty-eight. Y'all know this is um, a, an expensive item, so I thought it'd be perfect to put in a gift basket. All right, so twenty-two forty-eight. Then go to their Walgreens um, booklet. It's right in from the store where they have the ads, or it's maybe a possibility you can download. But you guys, the way things are going, I don't trust that. I like them to see it. So I grabbed the book, Lubriderm Lotion, sixteen or twenty-four. I made sure I got sixteen. All right, and it would take off two dollars off each of the lotion okay so it took off eight because I purchased four lotion two times four is eight bring me down to 1448 then I use four of these coupons save a dollar and fifty from the September 24th smart source now I always tell you when I do my coupon inserts preview some of the value may be different so I've noticed some of you guys in other states got two dollars and fifty cents off coupon now you see what i'm talking about in my area in the two up two down we only got a dollar and fifty so i have to go buy what i have so use four of those coupons four of those coupons would take off six dollars bring me down to eight dollars and forty eight cents and somehow you guys i earned five thousand points in beauty because um, they tell you when you spend $50 in beauty, you get 5,000 points. But I do want you to take note right now from October 15th through the 21st. If you get this barcode scan, what you're going to do is have them to scan all your products. All right. 
then have them to scan this okay so you can receive five times the points when you spend ten dollars or more so of course I did that and you're gonna get a um, dollar per 50 points per a dollar now you guys all these points and it, it it's just too much for me I did this because this lubriderm to me is a good deal considering how high priced they are so yeah so don't be looking for this Walgreens and Rite Aid deals too often believe that so I took the five dollars off so it's like getting all four of them for three dollars and forty eight cents or eighty seven cents each that's awesome you guys I really don't want to talk on how many points earned because I'm still confused because I don't even know how to read the darn receipt I, it's can y'all help me out in the comment section? Hey, Miss Nelly needs some help. All right. So I know I received the five dollars, um, five thousand points for beauty, which would definitely take off my balance. But how much am I supposed to be getting for this? It says two thousand points um, when I do ten dollar purchase. Y'all help me out, okay? So all in all, I still didn't do bad. And I know I came home with um, 1,100 points and maybe some change, which is equivalent to, I only could use, that's, that's what I don't like either. I got 1,100 points, but I'm only able to use $10, which is equivalent to 10,000 points. So even that bothers me because I'm like, I got 1,100 points there. Can I use $11? She's like, no. And for real, on my app, it shows I'm only able to use $10, which is 10,000 points. Y'all, I'm just confused. But all in all, it still worked out for my good. I'm going to keep trying, but I ain't going to be trying that often, okay? So, you like this video, subscribe, like, comment down the middle. Um, I'm just trying to wind down to get some more sleep, you guys. Love you guys. Smooches.